Google Partners Program puts new requirements on companies. A new Google Partners Program is launching later this year, which may require current partner companies to make a number of changes. In order for companies to maintain their Google Partner status, they will have to meet a new set of requirements that go into effect in June 2020. Google is sending emails to partner companies to help them determine whether they'll maintain partner status as per the new requirements. Greg Finn of Cypress North sent us a screenshot which shows Google comparing his company's current partner status versus what its status will be in June. As shown in the image above, this particular company would not retain its partner status as per the new requirements. The reason for this is clearly indicated. All upcoming changes to Google partner requirements include up until now, performance has been based on a company's growth in overall revenue and number of advertisers, as well as revenue growth and retention of a company's clients. As of June 2020, performance will simply be based on whether a company follows Google's optimization score recommendations. Google partner companies that meet the new set of requirements in June 2020 get access to a few new features such as a new partner badge new status of product capabilities categories, and new program benefits. Google Partner Feedback, so far. Response to these changes from Google Partner companies has been largely negative so far. The main concern is having to follow all of Google's recommendations in order to remain a partner. As Kirk Williams, at Kirk, states on Twitter. I think the primary concern for the rest of us is that the account recommendations are based on a variety of, potentially problematic, actions for individual accounts, which can now no longer be dismissed and will be counted against our partner statuses. In a tweet published earlier this month, Williams makes a case for why Google's recommendations for partners is problematic. If you think Google is primarily interested in seeing your business be successful in your metrics, then why is their agency gamification system focused solely on the three metrics that Google wants to increase? Thoughtful face, thoughtful face, thoughtful face. Hashtag chatpick.twitter.com slash fimp1lp3p. Kirk Williams, at Kirk, February 4, 2020. Some even feel so strongly against following Google's recommendations that they're willing to lose their Google Partner badge. Yeah, we saw that too. If that's the case we're just gonna ignore those and lose our badge. Most of the automated suggestions are crap. Gil Gildner, at Gildgildner. February 13, 2020. Others are saying the Google Partner Program doesn't offer the same value to companies that it once did. This is awful. Also I will always dismiss adding broad horrible keywords to my account. The program has become a joke. No one knows answers and they took away most in person for more on this story, visit the news article link.